Welcome to raigurukul.com. In this video, we'll discuss about how to import issue in Jira. So, if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates. Let's jump to the today's agenda. Then we'll move further with practical demo. So, we'll discuss here what is importing issue in Jira, how to import in Jira, and the practical demo. So, let's move to the Jira login credential where our project is already selected. So from this, before proceeding further, what is importing an issue? So sometimes we have written our test cases in Excel file or CSV file. And if we want to import these test cases inside our project, which will be used for the tracking perspective, it's very helpful for importing the issue directly from CSV so this will help us to minimize our effort rather than writing the test case or copying pasting from Excel to Jira. It will directly import each and everything with proper steps and detail. So for importing any particular issue, just have to click on create, select bug and click on import issue. We can before proceeding further with the import issue, we need to check on the configuration file, which all parameters we are looking to import it. For importing any particular issue, we just have to click on import and select, select the file. Before proceeding further with the selecting the file, we need to understand which all components are needed when we are importing issue in bulk so here we need to add the title name of the defect then severity priority reporter name so some of the parameters is basically required and if we have not set up with the configuration file which we have clicked just before this uh, few seconds so that configuration file is selected. So whatever configuration file contains each and every single will be populated with the detail. If the particular detail is not available, then that defect while creating the defect will get an error. So we just simply have to select on CSV file. So let's take an example here. Yeah. Port and when we will click on the use an existing configuration so if you have any configuration file we need to select the configuration file as well otherwise click on next once we will click on next it will ask for the project detail we have to provide the project name of our defect where we are creating if we have delimiters or date format if we want to provide the date and timestamp just add the date format here in DDMMYY format. So right now I am using uh, 08th of March. And the year is 2021. R is basically its time. So 06 24 and the P. Now once done click on next and it will go to map fields because our format is not sorry it's A. It will verify or map the field so if you have the detail in CSV file input you need to map this field like Spain, Epic name or the uh, Jira fields or the name of the defect. These all fields mapping will be required and once the mapping is done, we need to check the map values. So once the mapping of values also done after clicking on next, you need to click on submit within few minutes or within fraction of seconds, your all the defects will be imported directly inside the Jira. So this is all how we can import the issue which is already created inside the CSV file uh, which 
helps to minimize our effort rather than logging on multiple times. So that's all about importing any particular defect or a bulk defect in Jira. Hope you liked it. If you really enjoyed this session, consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates. Thank you for watching.